Hello everyone. So in this video, I'm going to just talk about a simple error that I got while trying to import the lookup table that I added into the input data. There's just, just two ways to do it. One is you can change once you have imported it, or you can do a change before importing it, which I will be speaking in briefly in this video. So let's just dive deep into the video. So let's just say you have added a lookup table into the Splunk and then trying to see this. See the Splunk lookup clothes dot c csv. It says the lookup table request a csv or kv the lookup definition. So you understand what did I do wrong and then you go back to check There's the lookup. You go back to check codes and CSV. You go to the tables, click all, and you see you have it. Codes dot CSV. Codes dot CSV, and then you did the same. Codes dot CSV. But you don't understand why it's not working. So I think the best idea would be like to go back. Lookups table and then see the file, this file, and then possibly would be what worked for me is that I deleted this and then re added it, re added the file, and this time what I did is that I typed the exact name of the file. Before that, I just wrote codes. I thought it works, but it didn't. So codes dot csv codes codes dot csv and then save it. I'll go back to this set as the input lookup. Go HTTP. That's not true. CSV perfectly works. Now we don't have the problem. Maybe another thing would be like if this is not your problem, you're just typing a typo when you type this, so that might be a problem as well. So I think this is how you fix it. Maybe we'll just check whether if let's just say I go back and type input CSV, then maybe that works as well. Maybe we we not this, this command but I think this works for the input lookup so I hope this was helpful then that's another one then to then be safe bye bye everyone